This is uh, my 2007 Nissan Skyline 350 GT. This is the uh, Type SP model. So it comes with the sports and premium packages. So, for example, you've got the uh, bigger 18 inch wheels there, uh, which are a lot nicer than the uh, smaller ones, the 17s. Um, this one also is very rare because it has radar cruise control. You can see it's quite dark, but that's the radar down in there, and that's what detects the car in front of you. Uh, come along to the side. You've got your uh, side view camera there as well. And in the back, and I've got the uh, Infinity badging on. Now the rear Infinity um, badge is off, but I've got that as well with me if you still want that. And you've got the back seats here. Quite a lot of leg room. And there's that. And here's the inside. Um, the sports model comes with these uh, paddle shifters here. Um, these are actually the same as the uh, Nissan GDR, the R35 model. Um, and they're really nice big ones and they don't turn with the wheel, which is nice. Um, I've got a DVD playing in here. Now, every Skyline's got a DVD play. The difference though is that this one comes with a button here. And what this button does is this button uh, um, grounds the park brake. So it lets you watch DVDs while you're moving. Most Skylines, you can only watch a DVD when the car is stopped uh, with the park brake on. So if I start driving, I can still watch the DVDs, which is you know really handy, of course. Um, what do we got uh, down here as part of the uh, premium package? You've got the heated seats for the uh, two front drivers. Um, you've got a electronic. This is part of the um, the premium package. You get the uh, telescopic tilt and steer. And when I turn the engine on and oh, sorry, when I get in and out the car, it will automatically move this into my position. Memory seats as well, function. Um, you've got the automatic front light steering button here as well, which is what moves the headlights when you're uh, turning the car. Um, up here in the dashboard, in the gauge cluster, we've got a few other bits and pieces. That's your uh, fuel economy. That's a timer, so I can press this button down here and it resets. The top one is time, and the second one is um, kilometers. Uh, that's your range, temperature, and this is uh, your maintenance settings and reminders, but of course it's all Japanese, so don't really use that. Um, that's your current fuel consumption, and that's that there. Um, here's the DVD playing in here. Pretty handy. Um, you've got up here as well, of course, your um, sunglass holder as well. You got two little lights up here as well to light up the interior and some lights as well up there in the back. Um so yeah. As you can see, I'm in drive, and video is still playing. Um, now, um, pretty much most models all have the multifunction controls here. Some of the newer models of the Skyline uh, do not come with these. Um, buttons here as well but of course they they work and um, 
over here now this is the uh, radar cruise control this is a really rear feature I don't it's pretty hard to come by one of these with this uh, function the uh, cruise control and as well as that the radar cruise so the way this works is you press um, the on off button first and now you can see it's got cruise there and those three bars indicate the distance that you want to keep between the car in front of you and your car. So if I go over here and I press this button over here, I can change that. So I press it once, there are two bars, and again there's one bar. So that means obviously I'm driving closer to the car in front of me. Um, and then of course you just set the speed with your normal cruise control functions. Uh, that's there as well. Another thing that you'll notice with this car is that um, the the paint which they use on this part, this trim on the steering wheel, and the paint they use on the trim here on the door is scratched very, very easily. But this car, the front seats, you can see here, the panelling is absolutely perfect. There's no scratches or marks. Same here as well. You'll notice a lot of skylines come in and they have all sorts of scratches there so that's definitely one other bonus with this model as you can see absolutely no scratch marks at all so it looks a lot tidier um, there are some marks in the rear seats not a lot but there's some but the front uh, absolutely uh, spotless